I have always been fascinated with story. Whether it be a book, a TV show, a movie, a play, a video game, a comic book, even just a story somebody tells me, I've always been drawn in and absolutely obsessed with them. When I was a very small kid, I used to act out fairy tales that I had been read to, and there's a video somewhere of me on a couch when I was three or four retelling Jack and the Beanstalk. As I grew up, I became obsessed with even more types of telling stories, so much so that I started writing them myself. I wrote myself into my favourite video games. I was the hero, my friends were my allies, my classroom bully was the bad guy taking over the world. I was a Pokemon trainer, travelling the world and catching all my favourite Pokemon. I got older again and I started writing short stories in class instead of doing my English work. But then I had an idea many years later and the idea got from point A to point Z. And I did it. I'm a self-published author, and that's great. But how do you get from the idea all the way up to the book? Well, a lot of patience, a lot of time, a lot of patience with yourself, a lot of patience that you have to have with others, a lot of patience that others have to have with you. I call this video From Knack Into Book because this is the name of a series I'm hoping to do for the next God knows how long. <laughs> um, J.K. Rowling uh, in 1990 was sitting on a train from Manchester to London that got delayed. And while sitting on the delayed train, she came up with the ideas that would eventually become... Wait. She pulled over one of these and scribbled out some ideas on it. And seven years later, this came about. Not this exact one, because this is the special edition cover. I don't know. It's the only one I have in the house. <laughs> Keep that in mind. Seven years. That's seven years of writing, rewriting, drafting out ideas, rewriting, plotting, rewriting, developing character, rewriting, applying to literary agents, rewriting, applying to publishers, rewriting, getting rejected nine times rewriting, and finally getting published. I feel like outside of writing circles, a lot of people think that it's all about coming up with the ideas and not about putting in the work. You don't wake up in the morning, put a seed in the ground and say, right, that's it, carrots for dinner. It doesn't really work like that. Instead, what we all have to do is cultivate those ideas, give them space to grow, water them, make sure they're weeded, all that kind of a thing, and work on them and work really hard on them too. And it's that part that I'm really interested in. It's the actual working part. Because I feel outside of writing circles, it's not really talked about. We as writers talk to each other about how long it takes, but when we're talking to non-writers, we don't mention the hours, the days, the weeks, the months, the years that can go into writing that novel that they read in two days. <laughs> we don't talk about the struggle that you have to go through. We don't talk about realizing you have to start over. We don't talk about um, worrying about, are my characters interesting enough? Is my dialogue realistic enough? Is my setting well described? Is my plot compelling enough? Will my readers care when this happens? Will my readers not care when this doesn't happen? These are all things that affect us when we're writing. And then when the book is out, it's comparing yourself to other writers, comparing yourself to, um, comparing your book to other books, and just saying to yourself, I'm not good enough. These are all struggles that every writer goes through, and I think we should talk about them more. So here I am, at the starting line of a marathon of writing my second novel. And I thought to myself, what will I have for dinner? And then I ate, and then I thought to myself, why don't I share this bit? Like, people have asked me, have you come up with ideas? I'm going to share it from now on. People ask me, where do you find the time? I'm going to share that. People ask me, was it easy? I'm definitely going to tell you now. It isn't, and it won't be, but I'm sharing it. And that's the idea behind this. I'm going to start here. And I don't know how long it's going to take me, but let's get going.